Hey, Blue Table fans, we're here with Blue Table painting painter Jeremy. That's probably more close than you ever wanted to get to him. And uh, he's got this converted hell cannon, right? So tell us a little bit about what you're doing here and uh, give us a technique. Well, that... I'm, uh, at this point, I am looking for things to make the model stand out a little more. Okay. Uh, I've got all the, the basic parts of it uh, taken care of, the, the metal parts and the bone okay. and what right. have you. So a big part of this is going to be the uh, demonic flames around the barrel. Okay. So those are going to be very bright. Yes, I have already, so. I've already put them white, um, which will give it a nice uh, bright contrast versus the darker metals okay. and uh, reds that are in the model. Right. So what I'm going to do is give it kind of a green glaze, Okay. a very thin glaze. And what this will do is, we did this on a similar effect on the vampire counts, which you Right, seen. this is uh, all so familiar. Yes. Okay, try not to have your hand block the action okay. there. Okay. And what this will do is, hopefully the darker colors will kind of seep into the recesses. Okay. Leave some of the white showing through. But don't you want it the opposite of that? Don't you want darker near the edges where it becomes like smoke or whatever it is? Well, in this case, it's not real fire. Okay. If I were doing flames, then yes, that's what I'd want. Um, but since this is more like fell fire, okay. uh, for lack of any other better terminology. No, that was a perfect term. Um, I want it to kind of do the reverse. It's going to okay. get brighter as it goes out. So show me the exact color out of your tubes here that you're This you're is using. foul green. Oh, I love that color. That is really fantastic. Okay, Vallejo foul green. So you water it down a little bit. Water it down. Right. And then uh, if okay, it... So what's the next stage? Well, now I'll need to let it dry a bit. But um, okay. I'll probably... I'll be going back in with uh, scurvy green. Okay, show me that. This is scurvy All green. Right. Love that color, too. Very dark. Very dark. Very dark. So what do you... And you get that into the crevices as well? Yes. And then in the end, do you re-highlight it with something? Yeah, if I, if I need to go back in, I'll re-highlight it again with, uh, with some pale sand. Okay. Okay, so not white. You not use white. like an off-white. Yeah. Kind of ivory color. Yeah. Okay, that's interesting. If I go back in with a pure white, it um, kind of washes it out. Okay. And doesn't make it look as uh, uh, burny. Bernie. Okay. Uh, and on that note, I will thank you very much. That's very insightful.